saxophones. In today's video, we're going to review the song More Cowbell by Mr. Mark Williams. What we're going to do is we're going to, going to go through the piece section by section and I'll play it along to a metronome and you can play along. We'll review the notes and rhythms that we need along the way and in the end, we'll put together a successful experience through this piece so that you can work on it on your own and build your comfort and confidence. So let's get started. More Cowbell is in 4-4 four, four time, and that means we're going to count 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, for each and every measure. It's marked Allegro in speed, so I've got my metronome set at 110 beats per minute. We'll play along to this metronome much like a, comp a conductor and we'll follow its steady and solid beat. All right, let's get started. We don't have any sharps or flats, so we're going to be playing our F naturals. That's our first finger on our right hand when we uh, encounter the note F. Now, uh, often we play our F sharps, but in this piece, all of our Fs are F naturals. So first fingers for those F. Let's start by playing the introduction. It's the first eight measures of the song. One, two, one, two, ready, and. practice section or your practice session your reed may be a little dry make sure it's moistened and ready to go let's do that section one more time one two one two ready go <laughs> section 9. It goes from 9 to 17. In this section, we'll also need those F natural fingers. Here we go. 1, 2, 1, 2, ready, and... <laughs> articulations. Each of the notes that have a staccato dot or a tenuto line or an accent, I'm making sure that I play each of those differently to give flavor and to give interest to my music. Also, I'm starting each and every note with my tongue on the reed. Make sure you're tonguing each and every note that you play. Now we're at section 17 and we're going to go from 17 to 25. In measure number 23, we need the note C sharp. C sharp doesn't require any fingers on our front six keys. So for C sharp, no fingers. Here we go. 17 to 25. Bum, 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 bum. And one, two, ready, go. <laughs> last five A's, one and two and three, accent those last five A's. How did you do on that? Were you okay through that section? If so, wonderful. Continue on with me. If not, consider rewinding the video a bit and playing that section again. You'll build your confidence and you'll build the correct note and rhythm patterns and then you'll be able to move on. Also, at any time, if you feel that we're going too fast, Consider pausing the video and working on your own metronome at a speed that's comfortable for you. 
So we're moving on, section 25 to section 33. I'll count the rests. One, two, here we go. Rest, two, three, four. Two, two, three, four. Three, two, softly play. <laughs> Good. Make sure you play that section softly so that the other instruments can be heard appropriately. Now we're at section 33 and we're going to go to section 41. I'll count those rests. Join me. One, two, ready, go. One, two, three, four. Two, two, three, four. <laughs> Great. We're almost through. We've got this next section from 41 to 50. <clears throat> In measure number 47, <clears throat> we have another C sharp, just like we did in measure 23. Remember that C sharp is no fingers. Here we go, 41, remembering those F naturals. 1, 2, 41, ready, begin. <laughs> for our last section, section 50 to the end. One, two, one, two, ready, go. Let's review those last four measures. 56, 57, 58, 59. One, two, ready, go. One, two, three, four. And there you have it. More Cowbell by Mr. Mark Williams. I almost said that wrong. More Cowbell. So I hope that you've enjoyed this video and you'll use it again a few times until you're comfortable and confident about playing your part to this song. Take it section by section, play along with the metronome, use your tongue, and make sure you do each and every one of those articulations. So until I see you again, keep practicing.